and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video if this is your first time on my channel hello i'm michelle i'm a mom to three gorgeous children i live in sunny queensland australia with my husband chris and my three beautiful kids and here on my channel i do lots of cleaning and organizing and home decor and today we are making over my middle daughter's bedroom she turned 14 last week and we decided to give her a bedroom makeover she had a lot of input into this room in fact majority of it was her input and then chris and i decorated it well he put everything up and built things and i was really super lucky to have my brother-in-law paint the bedroom for me he's a professional painter so that helped out a lot as well but i'm just going to pop up what her room looked like beforehand i didn't get any footage of it beforehand um this is how we decorated it a year ago but my mum came up and she cleared the room out for me and i forgot to film that but i hope you guys really enjoyed this video this video is a little bit different i've got kind of different relaxing music for this so grab a cuppa grab a cup of tea coffee whatever you like to drink and really enjoy this video but enough chatting from me Let's make this room over. So as I said in the intro, I am super lucky that my brother-in-law is a professional painter. So he came and painted Olivia's room for me. I didn't grab all of the footage of this. And yes, he just found a dead cockroach on top of the wardrobe. But I didn't film the whole footage of him cleaning, um, painting the room because... Um, I was just running around and I forgot to film it but you get the gist he painted the whole room for us and I think it turned out really beautiful the paint that we chose was a lexicon quarter strength and it's so nice and bright in here and I am just super grateful that my brother-in-law has painted this room for me and he is painting our kitchen cabinets and our ensuite as well so there will be some room reveals for you coming up Then Olivia drew some, well painted some artwork for her room um, and I think this gives it a really sweet personal touch and she just used watercolours to create some artwork. I washed all of her bed linen for her bed. It was all new bedding, so I thought it would be lovely and nice and fresh. I would love to know, do you wash all of your, your new bed linen or do you just pop it straight on your bed? But I just love the idea of getting new bed linen and washing it. And then when you jump into that fresh bed, it feels really good. <laughs> And now it's time to clear out the room of all the painting drop sheets and everything that my brother-in-law used. And these drop sheets are quite dirty. That's what's all the dirt is on the floor. And I'm just gonna give everything a really good vacuum and a steam mop and then a normal mop. And then later on, I realized when Chris built Olivia's bed, he had his work shoes on, so I had to give it another mop. But I'm just using my Dyson V10 for this and making everything all fresh. I clean all the windows and the mirrors and oh my gosh, it felt so clean and fresh in this room. And hopefully it stays this way. Um, Olivia's 14 and she does keep her room tidy, but she loves makeup. And there's always little makeup fingerprints everywhere, but she has promised me that this room is going to stay immaculate. And another thing with this room is Olivia actually went through a lot of her things and minimalized a lot of her stuff.
So it's the next day now and we are just popping the bed together. It is the Tava um, bed from Ikea. I didn't actually say that in the room reveal later on in this video, but it's the Ikea Tava um, bed and it was quite simple to put together, although I will admit I didn't really help at all. It was Olivia and Chris that popped it together.
starting off, as soon as we come into Olivia's room, we have this little macamre. I can never say this word right. Um, I'm going to say macrame the whole video, okay? But you know what I'm talking about. Um, we picked this up at the reject shop and I just hung it up with a 3M hook. Um, this is kind of irritating. I think I hung it wrong. But it looks really sweet as you walk into Liv's room. And then onto here we have Olivia's bed and I will link it below. Cannot remember what it was called. And her bedding is from Spotlight and it is um, cotton and linen. So it's linen on the top. Olivia originally wanted the same cover as in my bedroom, but um, they no longer stock it from Target. So it's in like a flax color. And because it's winter here in Australia, I have um, just some white flannel sheets, flannelette sheets, and this little rug so she can step on that before she hops into bed is from Kmart. And then coming along here, we have Duke. As you all know, if you follow me, my cats love being in all of my videos. And then over here, we have a Monstera. I had this and I potted it up at the beginning of quarantine and Olivia's popped it in her room. And then up here, we've framed these pictures and the frames are from Kmart. Olivia drew, um, well, painted that piece of art. And this is, I don't even know who they are, but I think they're YouTubers. Is that correct, Olivia? Yeah. They're YouTubers that she likes. And then over here is a panelled wall. It's actually floor panelling like what was in our ensuite. And um, we painted it white. Olivia originally wanted a black and timber room, but we've completely changed it into a light and bright room. And then this is from, so this is all floor panelling from Ikea and my brother-in-law painted it. The whole room is lexicon quarter strength, the ceiling and everything. And this hanger is from Bunnings. They have larger ones as well. And the coat hangers are also from Bunnings and some cute little items that she likes out on display. And then over here, um, we still need to get a new socket cover. But over here, we were going to pop in real hangers for Olivia, but we were worried if they fell on her head, <laughs> that it could be quite dangerous. So we've just gone for the IKEA hanging um, plants. And the pot and the macrame <laughs> is from Bunnings as well, and Chris just secured them to the ceiling. And this chair is also from Bunnings. Um, it is in current stock, so I will link everything below. The pillow is the cushion. This comes with the chair, and this cushion is from Kmart. The basket is from Ikea and the plant we got for $19.95 and it's beautiful from Bunnings. They have really good fiddle leaf figs at the moment. So if you are after some, definitely head into your local Bunnings. And then over here we have just the curtains that I have hanging in my whole house and they're the ribbon curtains from Ikea and the white um, rods as well i'll link it all we just like them draping on the ground eventually we are replacing the windows to white um so that is why they're green Olivia's pendant light fitting is from bunnings as well i'm not sure if they still stop it i did get it a couple of months ago and then over here on this little stand we may paint it white but chris built this ages ago just from some pine sleepers we have a diffuser she doesn't pop the diffuser on when the cats are in the room and it's got a Google Home and some of the linen spray from Adair's. This stuff smells amazing. I've mentioned that in cleaning videos before. And then up here, Chris has just secured these shelves to the wall. The brackets and the shelving is all from Bunnings. This little um, terra terra terrarium. I don't even know. terrarium is a from Kmart. And then I just got little mini succulents from Bunnings and the soil and the rocks as well. And she got some baby fresh as part of her birthday cake. And I've just popped it in a little jam jar. And these are from King Kong sales as well. So I think it looks really cute. Up here above her bed though, Olivia has a gorgeous sign. And I'll pop it in. I'll do an inset shot from the gorgeous Juanita at our Rustic Roots. It's very similar to the one in our room. And it says... She believes she could, so she did. I think that's exactly what she said. And behind yeah. her door, she has just got a little hook wrap for her towel. 
Thanks so much for watching guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you are new to my channel I would love for you to consider subscribing to my channel and joining my YouTube family and if you would like to follow along more on our Renault journeys you get to see behind the scenes more then definitely head on over to my Instagram where you can uh, join my Instagram family too. So I hope to see you in my next video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!